Welcome back. Recently, I had a comment asking how to adjust the featured item section on a Square online website. So I thought I would do a quick video to show you how you can adjust the items in the featured section of a Square website. And if this is your first time here, my name is Matt and welcome to Matt Reviews Stuff and Teaches Things. So without any further ado, let's jump right into the tutorial. We're on the main screen for the backside of our Square website. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're just gonna jump on over to the website section. Uh, to navigate to this area, if you're on your home screen, just click on the online section and then click on website which will take you to this screen from website. You want to go to edit site. It's a little bit deceiving because you would think you would actually go to items, but instead you're going to go to website. You're going to click on featured items. And then this is the area where you would add and remove items for your featured item section. So for example, if you wanted to add an item, you would literally just click the add featured item button. And then you could choose from any of your items uh, listed below. We'll just randomly load something. Let's grab these purple leopard earrings and we'll click save. And you'll see they're listed right here. If we scroll on the side, uh, you can see the, the layout for those items. And then we can literally reorder those if we want to move those up to the number two spot. We just grab it and drop it right there. And now you see we've got cat person sticker, the earrings, and that's how you would reorder it. And then to remove an item from the featured section, you would literally just select the item, hover over it, click on the trash can and say, remove from section. It's gonna ask if you wanna remove it. You can just say yes, and there you go. That's all there is to it. Now, the only way you can delete items from the featured item section is if you're using the custom selection option. You notice that you have other options such as most popular. If I click on most popular, I can choose the number of items that I wanna have listed there. So in this case, we have 10 showing. So if we leave it at 10, we click over here, you'll see these are all the items that are considered the most popular but you'll notice there's no option to delete any items. Uh, likewise, for all the other sections, for recently viewed, recently ordered, or recommended, you don't have any way to remove or add items. So the only way to adjust this is to do the custom selection. Once you've made those changes, then you just go over to publish, click publish, and we'll wait just a second. And there you go, your site's published and it updated and it's it's live out there right now. Uh, if for some reason you don't have the featured item section on your website and you wanna add a featured item, so then from the site design page right here, you would just click the plus sign, you would choose section, and then you would scroll down. In this case, it's up at the top uh, because I recently selected that. You would just find the featured item section, click that, and that'll add it to your website. And you can see where it would put it based on where this blue box is right now. So if I were to click it, you can also choose from different styles, whether you want to be a carousel look, a single large item, uh, anything like that. Once you've done that, you just hit publish and that will put the featured item site there. Uh, in this case, I don't want two featured item sections, so I'm just gonna click the close on the add section and go back to the way it was. So that's really all there is to it with the featured item section. If you need any help with any other items, feel free to leave a comment below and let me know. I'm happy to try to figure out that for you and help you out. If you found some value in this, it would be awesome if you'd like the video and maybe consider subscribing it or sharing it with someone else who has a Square Online store. And otherwise, I will see you in the next video.